In this video, we are going to see how functions work in C++ programming. Now, usually we know that when we have C out statement, and when we put some statement like let's say hello, and also let's put one more statement, okay, C out, and how are you? Okay, and also let's leave uh, one more line right here. And we know that for usually for the main function, the program read this one like from top to bottom, and it goes like it reads a hello, then print it out, then reads this one, and then print it out, and we get something like this, right? And here what we are going to see is we are going to see how to since this is going in sequence. We are going to see how to jump out of this sequence and do something else and then come back here and come into this sequence and let's see how we can do this now in order to do this one what we have to do is we have to create a new function to create new function we just put void and we can name anything you want like here you can name anything let's say i'm going to name it like name it like print something or print greeting and uh, bracket and I exactly follow this one as the main function and main function you can see we have parentheses and a curly bracket I'm gonna do the exact same thing and what's gonna happen is for example if you put uh, this one and you can declare this function inside in the middle for example if we print if we declare this one in the middle print greeting and uh, parenthesis okay then semicolon now the function goes like this read this one hello and it prints that one out and then it goes this read this one and see we have a function right here that's dic uh, and also that function is outside right so this will jump out of this one and do what we have right here and then it will bring will come back and do the rest of it so that's how it work now to illustrate this one let's look at an example for example uh, here I'm gonna say something like I'm gonna follow this one as exactly as main function so what we do is we put a curly bracket right here let's put some statement for example everyone so it's gonna go like hello everyone how are you let's see we get that one so to do that what I'm going to do is C out statement on top and here what I'm going to do I'm going to put everyone or leave a space right here everyone and uh, a new line okay and also a semicolon now it's going to read this one hello and it's going to go through this function and it says like I previously collect this information so I have to do something with this so it jump out of this sequence and do that part print that one and then come back to this sequence and print this one so let's see whether it works let's see how it look like and see you can see that it works right and that's how we jump out of sequence and do something else and come into the sequence and that's how functions works I hope this was helpful to you. See you next time.